Hey everyone, happy Friday Eve. I feel like I sound really weird because my throat hurts. <laughs> Today I'm doing a really cool giveaway and I hope you guys get excited about it because I'm really excited about it. Basically, I was invited to be a part of the whole tweezer man, I don't even really know what they're calling it, ambassador program. That sounds extremely official and maybe even political. Mm, not so much. It's mostly just about like eyebrows and eyelashes and stuff like that. It's all good. I don't think anyone would trust me with any kind of real actual ambassador-ness. So anyway, <laughs> I shall be the ambassador of eyebrows. What that means is I think like quarterly or every few months or something, Tweezer Man is going to send me cool new stuff from their line. Basically, I'm gonna get to try new stuff and I will just like come back and tell you if I like it, if I don't like it, or whatever. Um, this time around, they sent me this like cool little like roll up set that already has like long hairs on it. Excuse me. Oh, this is a different story. Don't look at that. It came with like all these millions of tools. Have you ever thought like, man, how many brow products does anyone really need? This is a lot of stuff for just your eyebrows. I haven't really gotten a chance to like try out all the stuff yet. And so I'm gonna try this stuff out and then I'll probably like just come back and tell you what I really liked. And you know, if any of it's crap, I'll come back and tell you that too. Um, I also got this really cool eyelash curler. You guys know I'm like an eyelash curling fiend. Like I gotta do it because my eyelashes are like womp womp like snuffleupagus just like blowing in the wind going straight down. So I live by the eyelash curler and this one's really cool because it looks like rose gold but obviously I haven't tried it yet so I don't know how it works but I will definitely report back when I know. That's some cool stuff that I got but in the conversation that I was having with the tweezer man person uh, who was asking me to be a part of the program she told me about the little collaboration that they were doing with Cynthia Raleigh the designer and it reminded me of my favorite tweezers that I have that I've been using for I don't even know how long like over a year definitely. I got these from Sephora. They're Tweezer Man and it was a collaboration with Betsy Johnson. It's like Marilyn kind of like with the whole Warholian kind of motif and I love these tweezers. I use them literally almost every day. I've been using them for so long. This is pretty much the whole reason why I decided to be a part of the program. Obviously I'm not going to be part of some kind of like um ambassador program with like a brand that I don't believe in. I love these tweezers. I think you will like them too. And that's why I got the hookup and I got a few of the Cynthia Raleigh products that I'm going to give to you guys because I like you and I think you'll like these things. So let me show you what it is. Oh, I have another thing that I want to show you guys that I got, but I'm not going to give it away. I promise it's not because I'm stingy, but it's because it like doesn't fit with the giveaway. Like I have three sets of things, but then I also have this extra mini slant tweezer, which is pretty much the same as my Betsy Johnson tweezer, but it's tiny baby that you could like bring with you anywhere you want. Not that these are big or clunky or anything, but still. They're tiny and they're cute because they're Cynthia Raleigh with like the little designs and the doodads and the doodles on them. Doodly boodly. It's a designer series special edition. Anyway, back to the giveaway. Basically, I'm going to do it through Rafflecopter and it's the way I did my last giveaway. I think it went really smoothly. I think it's really easy for you guys and I know it's really easy for me to like process the winners and like manage everything in one spot. Um, I'm going to put a link right below this video and it's gonna take you to my Tumblr page where I'm gonna put the Rafflecopter widget and all the instructions are on that widget. It makes it really easy. All you really have to do is be subscribed to my channel and so you're gonna have to enter that there on the Rafflecopter thing. And then there's also a couple of extra steps like liking my Facebook page, uh, following me on Twitter, um, tweeting me, different things, it's all right there. And I'll also add rules and regulations and stuff like that down below. If you're under 18, you need to have parents' permission. This is open internationally, so I'll send it wherever you are. There are gonna be three winners, and each one of you will win a set like this. 
It's going to be one of the original slant tweezers, which are the full size, just like my Betsy Johnson ones. And they've got like cool designs, all Cynthia Rowley like. If you tweeze your eyebrows or tweeze your mustache or whatever, you're going to like it. Don't tweeze your mustache. Next thing that you'll win is a nail file. It's also the Cynthia Rowley doodles. I've never tried their files, but you always need like an extra nail file. I mean, I do. I'm all about the nail file. I might look like I have mannequin hands, but these are real and they grow. And what's cool about this nail file is it comes with like a little case and it's like, wow, sorry. So anyway, yeah, if you win the giveaway, you're gonna get both of these. I'll send it to your house with a lovely little note and everyone will be happy and your eyebrows will be looking luxurious. Okay, so I think that's everything I have to tell you. I'm sorry, I feel like I'm getting sick and my mind is all garbled and going every which way. Um, if I forgot to share any information that's important, I will add it in the description down below. Basically, this giveaway is just like a thank you to my subscribers. I appreciate every single one of you guys. You guys are always supporting me and everything I want to do and everything I want to try. I really appreciate this and this is just a way that I can kind of like give back and connect and move my arms like this because that's fun also. I'm looking forward to trying all this stuff out and letting you know if it's cool or not because Tweezer Man is not too expensive and that's always nice. Go to the link down below enter the giveaway, subscribe to my channel. If you want to leave me a comment down below and tell me how much you love these tweezers as well, you definitely can. Or you can always leave a comment about anything else, like how creepy my voice is right now. I know. Hit me up on Facebook or Twitter or Tumblr or Instagram or anywhere that you are that I am also because it's Leanne says. The links are going to be down below. If you haven't subscribed, obviously you have to subscribe to enter the giveaway, but you pretty much have to subscribe anyway just because you're a cool person like that, aren't you? Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a really awesome weekend and I'll see you guys next time. Bye everyone. Anyway, whenever you are. Whatever time period, I'm open to it. Uh, I can't even. Who am I with this voice? You guys are gonna be so freaked out. I'm like Phoebe with the, the sexy voice. <laughs> but I don't like it. Meanwhile, these mannequin hands are on another level of scary. This is so embarrassing. I don't know if I'm getting sick or what. I never get sick. What? Netflix only has four seasons and for some reason I just thought it was like totally over. Anyway, I became rabidly obsessed with this show and was watching it until like four o'clock in the morning. Well, you know, there was kind of a span of time where I was like still working two jobs but like not regularly and I wasn't in school anymore and now I have this new job so luckily I finished Breaking Bad before I started this job. That would have been kind of destructive but I was just like watching it all the time and I watched those four seasons so disgustingly quickly and I don't really do that like that's not my thing like I know a lot of people do that and I'm not saying it's a bad thing well it was kind of a bad thing for me I was like worried about myself like my strange addiction breaking bad anyway I love that show oh my gosh I love that show